thick jungles, laced with streams and a sparse network of seldom travelled roads, define the northern region of the Japanese island of Okinawa. These are the rolling hills of the Yambaru, a verdant land situated some 500 miles south of the Japanese mainland. Explored by a few, yet forgotten by most, it is home to a diverse collection of endemic and in many cases endangered species of wildlife. These are the stories of some of them. Fluctuating weather in the Yambaru shifts between hot and humid summer days to storms and typhoons. One good thing about this constantly damp environment is that it keeps the region green. Roadside water evacuation ditches fill during and after the rains, but these in themselves offer shelter. Sword-tailed newts. Endemic to the Ryukyu Island archipelago, to which Okinawa belongs, they are found inhabiting shallow streams and man-made structures such as pipes and ditches. Although they lack natural predators, they share their habitat with a number of efficient and deadly hunters. The white patches on the forelegs of this fishing spider are not simply for show, for they serve a purpose. It uses them to hunt. They sit motionless by the water's edge with their forelegs resting on the surface. Acting as lures, the white patches grab the attention of any passing fish, shrimp or tadpole. They are voracious hunters. But there is another hunter in these humid conditions, and one that also poses a threat to man. Habu. Hime or Princess Habu are the smallest of the three venomous pit vipers found in Okinawa, but often the most encountered. Measuring up to 80 centimeters in length, they are easily recognized as a danger due to their diamond-shaped head. Their venom sacs are located in the back of their jaws. Whilst they often prefer to avoid contact, they will strike if one ventures too close. Treat this and all other habu species on Okinawa with a distant respect. <laughs> 